ways HIV cannot be spread, okay? HIV is not spread by hair or water. Mosquito, tick, or other insects. Saliva, tears, or sweat that is not mixed with the blood of a person with HIV. Shaky hands, hugging, sharing toilets, sharing dishes, silverware, or drinking glasses, or engaging in closed mouth or social kissing with a person with HIV. Drinking fountains, other sexual activities that don't involve the exchange of body fluid, for example, touching. HIV can't be passed through healthy, unbroken skin. How do you get haze? You can't catch haze. Haze is the most advanced stage of HIV infection. If you have HIV and you are not, and you are not on HIV treatment, eventually your body immune system will weaken and you will progress to AIDS. People with AIDS have short badly damaged immune system that they get a number of several illnesses called opportunist infection. People who are HIV negative can prevent getting HIV by using pre-exposure prophylaxis. Post-exposure prophylaxis is a way to prevent HIV infection after a recent positive exposure to the virus. There are other ways to prevent getting or transmitting HIV through injection drug used in sexual activities. So, HIV can affect anyone regardless of sexual orientation, race, ethnicity, gender, or age. However, certain groups are at higher risk for HIV and merit especially consideration because of particular risk factors. Is the risk of HIV different for different people? Some groups of people in the United States are most likely to get HIV than others because of many factors, including the statue of their sex partners, their risk behavior, and where they live. When you live in a community where many people have HIV infection, the chance of having sex or sharing needles or other injection equipment with someone who have HIV are higher. You can use CDC, HIV, STD, hepatitis C, and tuberculosis at last plus to see the percentage of people with HIV prevalence. In different U.S. community, within any community, the prevalence of HIV can vary among different populations. Gay or bisexual men have the largest number of new diagnoses in the United States. Blacks, African Americans, and Hispanic Latino are disproportionately affected by HIV compared to other racial and ethnic groups. Other transgender women who have sex with men are among the groups at highest risk for HIV infection. And the fashion drugs user remain at significant risk for getting HIV. Risking behavior like having anal or vaginal sex, we 